Hey, what's going on, movie lovers all over the world? It's your favorite internet sweaty, your boy Mikey Savage 21, bringing you another box office breakdown. And today's box office breakdown, we're going to be looking at the weekend of September the 1st through the 4th. It is a four day weekend. This is Labor Day weekend, so you can expect to see an increase in some movies. All right, so looking at the top five, coming in at number one, we have The Hitman's Bodyguard bringing in 13.2 million with a 29.3 percentage rate. And its total domestic gross now has been brought up to 57,966,926. Coming in at number two, we have Annabelle Creation bringing in a total of 9.1 million with a 19.6% increase. And its total domestic gross is now at $90,866,014. Coming in at number three, we have the movie Wind River bringing in a total of 7.8 million with a 70.6% increase and its total domestic gross now has been brought up to 20 million 270,857 coming in at number four we have leap leap brought in 6.2 million it had a 32.5 percent increase and its total domestic gross now is up to 12 million 760,985 and then rounding off the last one from the top five we have dunkirk dunkirk brought in 5.5 million and it had a 41.2 percent increase but its total domestic gross is now up to 180 million 204,578 and then shortly coming after that, we have Logan Lucky, Spider-Man Homecoming, The Emoji Movie, Despicable Me 3, and Girls Trip. All right, so it also should be noted that we did have the AMC's exclusive TV series, I should say, the first two episodes of The Inhumans. Uh, it didn't play so high on here. When I went and looked at the actual three-day weekend, it came in at like 18th place. And looking at it now, yeah, it's still way down there. Still way down there. So anyway, no surprise here. Again, nothing is coming out right now. Nothing came out this past weekend. We just had Wind River and Leap increase their theaters while the other films slowly decreased their theaters. We are now officially going to start getting to some new releases. Of course, the big movie that's coming out this weekend is It. And I have a feeling that Annabelle Creation is going to beat out the Hitman's Bodyguard and ultimately come in at number two right behind It. And then Hitman's Bodyguard will come in number three because, again, it is coming out and usually when you have two horror films coming out one of the films is at least gonna help plateau the other film because a lot of people are gonna probably go and see annabelle creation then go see it or they can see it then go see annabelle creation either way i think that it is gonna be the big number one factor coming in this week and i think annabelle creation is gonna be right behind it but in terms of this week's box office breakdown again hitman's bodyguard still at number one no surprise annabelle creation still at number two again i have not seen Wind Reaver or Leap, but it's no surprise that those theaters actually went up because, you know, they increased their theater intake. And then again, one went up by 70.6%. And then the other one went up by 32.5%. And then of course, Dunkirk, once again, is no surprise. Dunkirk is just is such an amazing movie. And Logan Lucky, uh, again, coming in at number six, which is not that bad. It's not too far behind Dunkirk. I think um, Logan Lucky, people are finally starting to give it a little bit more of a chance. People are starting to run out out and see it i think people are starting to say hey this has got daniel craig and channing tating a minute i need to really go check this out and get this movie a chance but in terms of that guys that's going to be it for the box office breakdown for the weekend of september 1st through the 4th again we had a four-day weekend due to labor day happy belated labor day if you celebrate that kind of holiday but what did you guys think of the box office weekend for this weekend do you think that this is starting to get a little bit better in terms of what we had last week and where it was being as credited as the worst box office weekend in 15 years you feel like this weekend is a little bit better also what do you think the hitman's bodyguard and annabelle creation are gonna fall in places of terms of second place and third place do you think hitman's bodyguard is still gonna hold strong and be over annabelle creation or do you think the it movie is ultimately gonna plateau annabelle creation above the hitman's bodyguard let me know your thoughts on all of this down in the comment section below as always if you enjoyed this video please make sure you subscribe punch that subscribe button also make sure you tap the little bell so you can be notified every time a video comes out and youtube's algorithm is weird so you 
you know you have to play around with it sometimes but as always thank you so much for checking out this video and as i always say remember to become a savage stay a savage and peace out y'all oh and one more thing before i forget make sure you guys stay tuned because i have a lot of movie reviews that are actually going to be coming out so that's another reason to hit that bell because i have reviews for annabelle coming up i have throwback review for super bad coming up i finally have my review for kingsman the secret service coming out i also have my review for the hitman's body I have my review for Logan Lucky. I have finally seen all the movies that have came out. So, yeah, expect a lot of reviews to be coming out. But thanks for watching, guys. Peace out. Later.